Hey everyone, hope everyone is doing well. So, I just woke up, was having my coffee, and Withering Waves dropped their, well, they revealed, they leaked their new characters coming out in 1.3. That's crazy because 1.2 ain't out as yet. Normally, I'm accustomed with Genshin dropping their leaks, well, their reveal for the next patch of characters like a day before the um the launch of the next patch or maybe on the day but they dropped it so let me check it out and plus there is some animations about these characters not no gameplay as yet but just some animations so the first character very interesting a four star character and how to know if a character is four star or five stars if there's a four star you will see three here and then one over here meaning four then if it's five star you will see four over here and then one more which will make it five but for some reason Jinshi, if you didn't know, has five here and one extra. I don't know if why. So the first character is Yuhu. Yuhu. Yeah. Um, as you see here, four star again. We don't know the element. Oh, yes, we do. She's ice. She's cryo. Mm, there we go. Here you go. A special edition of my poetry collection, hand signed by Moi. You are welcome. Oh, you are a natural expert in identifying antiques is a capable speaker with distinctive taste. When dealing with treasures and antiques, the jubilant dynamo settles into calm perception, tracing their distant past through, I said through instead of true, wrinkles and textures. Hmm. Okay, that's the fourth star. And there's a little animation, so let me watch it one time. Very cool animation, I would say. You know, nothing too special. That's kind of nice. And then, as you see, I don't have any TikTok thing here. So how do I do go back and forth? I think. Oh, no. Continue as guess. And then we have the five-star character, the Shorekeeper. Now, she is giving out some Black Swan vibes, as you see. I always love the design of Black Swan. So I'm kind of, you know... I'm actually kind of interested in this character. You see the kind of split going down the middle here? Mm -hmm. uh, the shorekeeper, uh, uh, you see, force here and then one here. That's five star and five star is Black Shores. Isn't Black Shore like a new region or something we get in? I think so. Um, the shorekeeper, this name suits me well enough. It aligns with my purpose and drive. They only exist because of you. Um, archive the shorekeeper of the Black Shores, a mysterious divine being governing the existence of aloofness, emerges in response to your summon. Also, is it like, I mean, it, it, is it like some type of cult or something, or, or or like some type of um like organization? Having spent eons in guardianship, the first stirrings of emotion. I'm I'm sorry if I'm reading it bad. My screen is given like so much trouble. I need to get a new monitor. Um, desire awaken within her heart, fostering a firm determination to connect with the world. And you know, obviously they have to throw in this and with you. And plus, there's some animations here as well. Let's check it out. Hmm. Of course, they have to zoom in there. I ain't complaining, right? <laughs> very, very nice character. I would say she's well designed. Um, it's these new two characters are a bit different than the last set of characters we got because they were more like um, like these characters looks more um, how to say it? You see, like more of a, a vibrant clean kind of color pattern they used on them this character as well a shorekeeper um, cryo as well um it doesn't say what the element is but if i had to guess it probably i feel it might be cryo so these are the two new characters coming to withering waves in 1.3 now this makes it very very interesting because I think that I heard something about the shorekeeper might be in a support healer. Now, we only have one five-star healer, and she's a pretty good one, Verena, because she's a attack buffer as well. And if you know anything about limited five-star units, they usually try to bring the best of the best and plus they add more into it. 
So I wouldn't doubt if Shorekeeper is like an ultimate healer and buffer. So I wanted to talk about Zeshi in another video, but if I had to say, if you really want to maximize Jinshi's damage, and Changli too, I believe Zeshi is pretty good with Changli as well. You go for Zeshi, right? But I don't really think that she is a must pull. Now, I always say supports, like dedicated support units, they will always carry you throughout an entire lifespan of a game or for a very, very long time as far as they could carry you. For example, Kazuha, for example, um, Bennett, Then we have characters like Furina, Nahida, those characters, they will always be used in Genshin Impact. Now, if this character was to be the ultimate buffer or healer, then, you know, you're going to be using her for a very long time. And the, the, the rate that um, Withering Waves is taking things, it looks like they don't want to keep giving you a ton of sustained units. They want you to learn the patterns of the enemy, how they attack. They want you to learn how to dodge, how to counter, how to time things. But if they start drowning the, the game with a ton of, um, of healers and sustainers, you know, it kind of takes away what they want you to do. But you never know because it depends on the market. So two very cool characters come in. You know, I'm more interested in the adult character and she looks pretty fine. Um, this looks like a support as well. So it's up to you guys what you guys want to do. If you guys want to hold off till 1.3, personally, I will be holding off till 1.3. I think and I really believe that we are getting um, Zhao Zhang Liao, the limited five star electro dps and that should hold you for a couple of weeks it should satisfy your hunger for something new to build so it's up to you guys if you guys want to go for zeshi or if you want to hold off and wait for two new characters which might actually increase your enjoyability with the game because that's what supports do right that's all that's the um the two drip marketing. Oh, and look, there's a new arm. Um, she's actually finishing off her artwork. I think this is Zhang Lia Rover, and that's herself. This looks good. Um, as you guys see, I am not on Twitter or anything. And yeah, so let me know what you're going to do. Are you skipping 1.2 or are you go or pulling for Zeshi? Or are you going to save for um, Heavenly Black Swan? I I'm going to call her White Swan. <laughs> Hit the like and subscribe if you enjoyed this video. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Take care. God gave me a retry. I pass it on to my left. Because knowing that you never be mine. is worse than being a ex. And now my soul is cursed with lies. And I've been burning, sinking in hell. I mix melatonin with cough syrup to get closer to my death. And I'm tired.